first of all, it's very critical that the, those who are managing pensions, be they asset managers or the pension fund directly, use the right skills for, for these investments. Uh, using both strategies for maximizing on asset allocation uh, movement as well as the movement in the underlying assets in the first place, making sure that whenever they say the inflationary environment which may push asset prices upwards, they shift resources or the investment toward those assets. And whenever those uh, uh, assets again decline in value, they shift to other assets and not stay locked in with one asset allocation strategy or investment strategy. So the investment strategy is very, very critical. We as a government as well have said we stand ready to compensate uh, those who lost their pensions, both in 2008, 2009, when we shifted from the uh, Zimbabwe dollar back then to the US dollar. And, and in 2019, when we shifted from the one-to-one -one exchange rate uh, uh, into the Zimbabwe dollar, both those uh, you know, uh, compensation mechanisms and processes are in place and we're busy adding more resources uh, uh, to those. So really, uh, 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 you know, this is very critical that we should support our pensions. When, a pension fund, when pension funds are managed well, they are also a source of development because they can invest in roads, they can invest in various infrastructure, they can invest in businesses. In fact, most of the pension funds are, are invested on the stock market, for example. So they're invested in businesses, supporting their businesses. So managing pension funds well enables the, the country also to benefit from those resources uh, uh, through supporting uh, uh, development. There, there are two types of uh, uh, really pension funds that you come across around the world. There is what you call a defined contribution, uh, which is where uh, uh, you know the, the pension payout is determined by returns from the market. The other is what you call a, a, a defined, a, a, you know, a, a payout, a, 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 you know, a, a pension fund where the payout uh, uh, is, is well is, is defined, a defined benefits as they call it. So, so both of those require that to, to guarantee a specific payout under a defined a, a benefit fund, the returns must be, you know, uh, self sufficient. It must be well managed. There's no escape. Equally, in the defined contribution aspect, again, the returns that uh, the, the, the fund makes are also critical. So either way, uh, uh, for each type of fund, it's important to have the right skills, the right fund fund managers, uh, uh, but also as government, we're doing our part to make sure that there's proper regulation of this pension fund under IPEF, and, and we're putting these two compensation mechanisms.